Hello, good morning. This is the solution of the solar tower exercise. You see on the pictures the tower and the greenhouse. The problem, remember, a project of tower can produce electricity from the hot dry hair desert. According to the calculation, the tower would be 800 meter height, an updraft of hot air produced by greenhouse go to the turbine to produce electricity. Two questions. First one. How many towers would be necessary to have the same power as a nuclear power plant? Second question. What is the source cell needed to have the same power as a tower? Solar tower, of course. We know that in Europe, in Belgium, for example, we receive 270 watt per square meter. With an efficiency to produce electricity with a solar cell about 15%. Solution of the first question How many towers would be necessary to have the same power as 1100 megawatt for a nuclear power plant? The electricity power for the turbine. How many turbines? 28 turbines. 28 turbines. One turbine is 4.5 megawatt. You have 126 megawatt for one tower. It is the power, not the production of electricity. Remember, it's not the high energy, it's the power. The number of towers needed is very simple the power of one nuclear central. You divide it by the power of one tower, solar tower, and you have about nine solar tower. Second question. If we want to produce and to have the same power as a solar tower with the photovoltaic cell, which is the area, how many square meters we need? One solar power is 125, 26 megawatts. One square meter of solar cells produce how many electricity? The efficiency, this is the number. How many watts? 270 watts. One square meter of cells produce this number of electricity. Thus, it's not so complicated. You have the power of one solar tower. You divide it by the electricity power of one square meter of photovoltaic, and you have this number of IRA, very enormous. Mine.